what is this? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. It's freezing cold, it's rainy, and I am gonna have a cozy reading night. I have to work all day tomorrow. I'm busy on Sunday, so tonight is gonna be my night for coziness and amazingness and for doing nothing besides reading. I'm gonna heat up some pizza, maybe take a bath. I am freezing, but I wanna show what I quickly got from the library that was on hold for me. So first of all, I got Catherine of Aragon, which um, Lauren from Lauren in the Books just recently read because basically she's obsessed with the six or six. I think it's just called six. Um, and I'm seeing that the day after school gets out on June 11. So um, I thought it'd be cool if I knew a bit more about the wives of Henry VIII um, before I went to see the musical but if this book is boring then I don't really care that much <laughs> I don't know we'll just see how it is and then I got mouse because I think that um, my priest at my church was doing a presentation on this book but I don't know if I missed it or not so if I missed the presentation then I might read this another time because I am interested in eventually getting to this but the whole point in reading it is just so that I can um you know be ready for the presentation so yeah if I missed it I'm not really super in the mood then I got I forgot what this book is called but it is oh yeah the dream game and the book is like so vintage I heard about this from Bert from past story time and then finally I've heard about this a bit I don't remember where I first heard about it but the summer book which is a Swedish very very short shorty so i don't know if i'm gonna read those today um yeah i'm gonna get myself feeling more situated with having food in my belly and not freezing and then i'm gonna settle down and see what i feel like reading Okay, I'm working at the nature center all day today, like nine hours. Well, except for the fact that I showed up late, but that is another story, but it is so nice outside. It feels like summer. Apparently this is only the case for one day because it's supposed to be freezing cold and rain again tomorrow. Indian food before. Forty-two, and it was a very nice safety car. So, I mean, at least, I don't know how often. There's finally buds on the trees.
almost home from family book club. It was an amazing time. I'm going to wrap up this video here, but we read um, The Last Thing You Surrender by Leonard Pitts Jr. Everyone loved it so much and it just gives me so much joy to put a book in the hands of people and have them love it as much as they did. So that made me so happy. And then I reminded them, I should probably not do this while I'm driving. I reminded them that like, hey, there's a sequel coming out and they didn't really remember I had already told them that just because they had no context for that you know, statement until they read the book. And now that they were like invested and loved it so much, they got so excited that he had a sequel to it coming out eventually. It's cur currently being written. So it's not even been close to being born yet. But um, yeah, it was a really fun weekend and my winter has started. So I'm gonna just soak up this week. I got my vaccine today, my um, second booster. So we'll see if I have any impacts from that, but I'm just gonna kind of have a cozy week this next week. Hopefully get loads of reading done, although I'm also really into watching Vera right now, which I know is a super old show, but I love it so much. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys have an amazing week and I will check in with you later, bye.